Hey guys, this is Elige, and I just want to show you guys how powerful our new creator studio is uh, at Refrag. There's so many different things that you can make, pretty much anything that you can even think of for different types of arenas that you want to practice or certain types of things. And I'm just going to get right into it and show you how it's done. And you can also publish these right afterwards for anyone to use. So to start off, you're going to have to go onto Refrag, into whatever spot you want to go to, do dot clear arenas, just to clear any arenas that you possibly could have made before or anything that you had loaded and then you'll go dot add arena and then whatever you want to put for me i'm going to put a liege underpass because we're going to make an arena towards underpass and then you'll do dot menu to get what i have open right now go to creator arenas and it's right here so you just press one and then we can get started into making whatever we want so for me when i'm thinking of what arena i want to do i'm thinking about where i am normally going on this map when i'm playing and right now i'm defaulting towards underpass all the times on my team so i'm going to want to do something kind of similar to what i've used before in uh, angle trainer and you have to start off with adding bots and spawn points so first i'll add a spawn point with five so i'll start off here and i'll just go into putting where i want to put the bots so for me I'm just going to put you know, some common angles that people are playing and we'll put add bot for here. We'll just put one here, a little bit of an off angle. We can put one that's like looking down at us. This is the standard spots that people are usually playing. We can put another one here since they're usually holding this. So they just go into like to the whole process for when I'm going out underpass, like how I want to be clearing certain angles. Maybe there's an angle that I'm normally having trouble with that I can just add a spawn point to and I can get real comfortable playing against these types of against these types of spots. And now after you put all the spawn points for the bots and yourself, you just press play arena and you can test whatever type of thing that you wanted to practice. So if I was actually gonna walk up underpass, here this guy, see if he's peeking me. And it would pretty much look just like that. And you can be really creative you can make the bots move, you can have them shoot back at you at different intervals, you can do a lot of things, so the creator studio is yours. And now that we have an arena that we like, now you can save it doing dot save set and you can put whatever you want for this. So I'll just put a leisure one for now. And to actually get it, so it upload it successfully, you do dot menu, you go to my custom sets, and now I see it here and you can actually publish this for everyone else to be playing and I forgot to mention that you can save as many arenas you want in a certain set and to actually publish it you just press 3 here you type dot publish set and it will be published for everyone to use so now on the website you can just go to my account in the bottom left press my profile I'm already here and it will go to community content and this is how you're gonna find the sets that you just made so now we find a liege one, which I just made here. We're gonna go ahead and click on it. And now we're gonna wanna put in a description and some tags for, for what it actually is. So people will see if they actually wanna use it. And description of this, I would just say, standard angle training, uh, angle clearing in underpass as a T. That's how, that's how I would personally describe it. You can definitely be way, way better with your description for how you want other people to, you know, come along your set and, and subscribe to it and everything. So I'm going to save that description. So on tags, now we want to just show exactly what type of community mod that we just made, what type of category it falls under. For me, I'm going to put angle trainer, I'll put T, and you want to just be as accurate as you can so people can see what they like exactly. And if you're satisfied with that, now we want to make sure that you know, you obviously subscribe to it because uh, it's your own and you want to make sure that you have it, but it is under my custom sets anyway. And you can share it now, pressing the share button, and you'll have a link on your clipboard that you can just send to anyone if you, if you want other people to be using your set.